Hi, my name's Stephen Hand from Archery Supplies. These are the Eastern Advance shafts. They're a 4.2 diameter carbon shaft. Um, new for Eastern. And when I say new, I don't, I'm not sure. They're new for me. So 4.2. It's a, like a Victory VAP. It's like a carbon one. It's generally an arrow used for target archery, although some people do hunt with 4.2 shafts. Thinner shafts than a 4.2 will be an Eastern X10, Skyline Paragon, the CA320s from Pandaris, um, the Ice Point from three from Pandaris is a 3.2. 3.2 is used for more target archery, less wind, right? So, right. So a bit about the Advance. That's a little bit, little bit lighter than other 4.2s. So, in 400 spines, I can compare it. Your X10s are going to be just like roughly. Um, 8.7 yeah champions from Pandaris are 8.15 these are 7.9 Pierce 7.6 and victory game is 7.2 um, so it's not as fast as some but faster than others it's basically a bit of a robust arrow that that's why I see it doesn't come with inserts doesn't come with points so when I like look at this, I say, how does it fit in the market? So I was like, well, let's compare the other 4.2 arrows. This is the Pandaris Champion Arrow. It's a three ton carbon arrow. I'm not sure how they make the Eastern Arrow because there's nothing on their site to say what type of carbon it's made out of. There's different grades of carbon. So to do with strength and how much resins in the arrow. So the more carbon, the less resin, the stronger it will be. This is a 30-ton carbon, so this is pretty strong. 0.001. The Advance comes in two models, 0.025 and 0.005. The 0.25 is $200. That's Australian. Um, American, $134. The Champion is $85. So it doesn't come with inserts, doesn't come with points like the Advance. So the Champion, less than half price, $85 versus $200, basically. This is your VAP Gamer Shafts. Comes in two models. This is a Gamer, so 0 0.003. Comes in the Target model or the Hunting model. The Hunting model comes with inserts, which are an insert that go inside the shaft and wraps around the outside of the shaft. Comes with Nox. The Target version comes with Nox also. Victory Gamers. Sell for $185, so it's a little bit cheaper than the Advance, um, and a little bit comes with like knocks and stuff, so a little bit lighter. In America, they're $6 more than the Advance, but then they come with stuff, so about the same sort of, about the same sort of, about the same sort of money, so very competitive in price is what the words I'm looking for. Look, I've shot VAPs for a number of years, at least five years. I've never broken any. I can't compare the construction versus the Advance because I just don't know enough about the Advance yet. Gold Tip Pierce. Um, gold Tip Pierce, these are 0 .005. Um, $175 Australian. But the thing about Gold Tip is they've always been like regarded as a very tough arrow. However, they've been a little bit more expensive. This is... Similar price to the Advance, but not quite as straight. Um, in US, a little bit cheaper, 114 versus 135. These ones come with, I was gonna say they come with inserts, but these ones don't. They come with knock. So, so I think Easton's price the Advance at a pretty good price point. Um, it's pricing it right up against the Victory Vaps, which is regarded as a very good arrow, and you could argue the Vaps are a little bit cheaper. But then you've got to compete against the Chinese product, which is straighter, and I'm going to say it's 30 tonned carbon, which is a very, very high quality carbon um, at half price. But it's probably not going to be available in America. So, um, so my summary of the Advance, if you're in America, the Advance is going to be a popular product. Okay, so my summary of the Eastern Advance, there's a whole bunch of people shooting target archery with these arrows. Um, they are faster than your X10s, cheaper than your X10s. Um, I've got top archers in Australia shooting these arrows. Um, in the wind, they'll get more wind drift than an X10. However, when it's not windy, um, 
I'm going to say the Archer got better groups with the Advance than X10s. The Advance is very similar price to other, I'm going to say other competitive arrows, and I'm going to say well the Pandaris is significantly cheaper. Um, but if you're in America, these will now be a competitive option to the other arrows in the market at the 4.2 target arrow. I'm Stephen Ham from Archery Supplies, and this is Marlon. Now she's come back. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.